Oi. Welcome to Skulls Above. Maybe the final. Probably the final. Could be. This is recorded in the night before I get my wisdom doof removed, which is gonna probably kill me so badly that I probably can't talk for one or two days anyways, so it would be better if this is the final part. Return to the monolith. I I'm guessing this game won't go on for much longer. And I will upload this on the same day of my operation, Monday. I'm right now having teeth problems since a few days anyways. Right now I can't really eat anything without me... Laboratory. Okay, this probably is the end. Is this the end? I can't eat stuff right now before my teeth just start to hurt in a weird way that just seems like a nerve pulsating through my body. Lovely stuff. I love teeth problem. I don't have much problem with other kinds of pain. Especially if you've seen my music video that I recorded lately and thrown out. But teeth problem, it's just... Makes me feel so helpless against that stuff. Ah. I probably will play more Returnal without commentary. That's a plan. I'll have some court gameplay without commentary. I'll try just one more video I can throw out when I want to. Oh, the music is hyping up. It's already almost full. And the recompilation yes. is complete. The seat is ready, and the barrier is down. Take it. And when I can talk again, the outer worlds finishing my perma death in this month is probably very realistic, especially if I died and it's finished One anyways. Thing remains. You need the master access. To activate the monolith connection to the vessel. Vessel, 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 vessel. Okay, let's get that done. Yeah, this should be the final part of the game. Will be a big midnight upload. This is you. In a way. Her name was Naya. She was a scientist and one of the custodian's creators. She always looked at the universe with eyes wide open. But her hunger for knowledge, her desire to unlock the code made her blind. And for that, she and those around her paid the ultimate price. Before her demise, she realized that the custodian would not stop with her people. She learned of his plans to reach across the stars and find new species, new specimens to experiment on. Her own kind was responsible for their fate, but not these people. Naya couldn't bear the guilt for them as well. So she created another entity, similar to the Custodian, but smaller in scope, made out of just one connectome, her own. She gave the entity her mind, but also her heart, as you would say. The purpose of this entity would not be to find the code of life, but rather to aid life. To aid you, Kate. She Ooh. created me. Naya made me in her image, and out of her own neural map. Her knowledge, her memories, her being. I became a whisper of what she once was. And then I was imprinted to you, through nanomachines in your body, inserted when you were resurrected for the first time. After I died in the Hermes crash? Yes. Only these nanomachines did not mutate you. Instead, they brought us together. They put me in your mind. Oh. And they did something else too. You see, Naya could not stop the experiment, as the custodian had already taken full control. But she was able to give you a special state within it, 
Using the nanomachines, she gave you the status of a control variable. The system would restore you in case of death or mutation, and keep you as a constant, alive and unchanged. Naya hoped this would give you a chance to stand against the custodian and protect your people against him. She was right. And now, you must take the fight to him. You just need the master access. Once it is consumed, you will be able to reach the vessel and reach his core. How do I get this master access? You already have it. I am the master access. Go to the, the master. I will do the rest. I... I just wanted you to see her before I go. I wanted you to see... me. I... I'm glad you did, Naya. This is a cool, well thought out story for sure. The only thing they could have toned down is the mid sentence echo. Reduce that a little bit. I'll take Custodian. The entity is ready. These people do not deserve our fate. I will store her essence in the nano machines, the same ones the Custodian is using to induce mutations. However, these will not mutate the host. Instead, they will graft my connectome onto their genetic structure. The entity will carry my thoughts and access privileges, thus making them available to the human. I am also using the nanomachines to grant the human a special status. The system will see them as a control variable, preventing mutation, permanent injury, and even death. I, uh, I just hope it is enough. These people do not deserve our fate. <laughs> That's a cool voice without the echo. Uh, very foggy too. I might try this game later with a reshade, because that's just what I do, put reshades on everything. Definitely has a lot of potential in the not so foggy areas to look cool as hell. And uh, I believe there are mods already. I can look it up later, let's see how long this part is. Maybe some fog reduce mod would make sense. I will input the coordinates to the vessel and grant you master access. This will consume me, and I will not be able to aid you further. <sighs> Naya... The custodian is aware you're coming. He will defend himself. You must insert the seed into his core, which will destroy both him and the vessel. You will die, but the system should restore you back on the planet. However, the custodian was right, Kate. This will also destroy your means of getting back to your world. Uh. We don't have a choice. We'll find another way back to Earth. The custodian must be stopped. Agreed. I will leave something for you. A parting gift. Maybe it will show you a path back home. You will find it in the monoliths after your battle. Oh, yeah. I am sad I won't be around to see you defeat the custodian. But after watching you all this time, I have no doubt you will prevail. I believe in you. Kate, yeah. your people have such potential. Do not repeat our mistakes, but never stop searching for answers. Never stop being hungry for knowledge. Goodbye. Goodbye, Naya. Thank you. For everything. Bye. Meta... F what? Metahedron? Met me Metahedron. I don't know how to pronounce it. Mainframe of the planet. Okay. Oh yeah. We have more cool looking screenshots. This is the inside of the Metahedron. It's... Mesmerizing. Uh, Alright. Time to face the custodian. Very red. Got this, oh. Kate. Oh. 
Are they actually going to throw me into the final boss fight right here? Yeah. Definitely. I can already shoot the bad boy. Oh, nope. Game says no. Uh, I'm guessing electricity. Because of the bubble on top. Yeah. That's a final boss fight. I have decided to offer you a way back to your planet. A gift from one scientific mind to another. You will awaken on your home world. This will all be just a distant memory. The remaining human specimens will suffice. I am close to unlocking the code, fulfilling my mission. You will find solace in the fact that you were a part in one of the greatest discoveries in the history of sentient life. I will not leave my friends here with you, monster. You're not surviving this. Disappointing. I preferred the optimal solution to this conundrum, one that would benefit all sides. But you leave me no choice. It's only a matter of time. Before I break the protection my creator granted you. I think we should take his deal. That sounds like a good deal to me. Let's see how many of your deaths will be required to destroy you permanently. Um, you. Uh. Seems like he's. Yeah, poison. Poison it is. Interesting. Poison and now electricity. Ooh. Oh, baby. Up, I heard you. Oh damn. No! Ah, fuck. Up using the battlefield. <laughs> oh, boy. Reload. Okay. Parameter change. What? Time.
Understand. The Omega. Run! Uh. Not cool. <laughs> There's so much god damn. Broken floor. Oh. I know I seem to way to go, but. Guys, huh. I need to slow things down. Okay, poison now. Oh boy! Die here. 
far away from home. I refuse. Damn it, trolls. Come on, reload. Hit him here like that. Maybe I need to get close though. But it's kind of silent right now. So it's just. something wrong here Be the fire of the way. Truly dance. That's how we kill him. He just stands there. We shoot at him. That's not how it landed, right? Kenny, you bastard. Where it's me. Am I? Is this the core? I have to insert the seed. I alone have the power to bring you back to your homeworld. Ending me will sever that possibility. The knowledge will be lost. One of the universe's greatest mysteries will remain locked forever. Reconsider, human. You will never see your planet again. I feel like I know that voice. But it's definitely auditude down this Richard and Naya, you monster. Ah, 
firework. Yeah, 10 hour campaign. But like, that's the standard for indie games, which ain't that bad actually. It's a good standard of for like. Ah, uh, 10 hours for 20 euros, something around that price mark. It was. It's not that bad. I'm pretty happy with this game. I like it more than Atomic Heart. And I feel like a little bit more than Returnal 2. More slow and smooth gameplay. My. Kate! You're back. Personal log. Mission specialist Kate Ward. The entity known as the Custodian, the one responsible for everything that happened to the SCAR team, has been destroyed. His existence endangered not only members of my team, but potentially all of Earth as well. And who knows how many more worlds. He was a product of recklessness rather than malicious intent, but the consequences of his actions were tragic nonetheless. So many lives lost, including our mission commander, Richard Robinson. He will be dearly missed. Naya and her people, creators of this place and of the custodian, were in many ways similar to humans. Scientists, explorers, seekers. They discovered something incredible. Something that might hold the secret to all life. Perhaps this was a mystery that was not meant to be unlocked so soon. Their fate should be a warning to us all, but not a deterrent. If anything, I now know that even in the vastness of universe, there are others like us. People looking for answers. That gives me hope and makes the great distance from home just a little smaller. Naya left us her gift, just as she said. The monolith has the coordinates of a planet that I hope supports human life. I believe it to be Naya's homeworld. I don't know what awaits us there. New dangers, new discoveries, perhaps even a means to return to Earth. These are all unknowns. But what is certain is that we stand together. Mike, Tam, and I. We are scientists. We are a team. We are scars. We will find our way home. up to part two mad hat games I feel like i got pretty much every trophy too skip sorry oh, i'm just gonna look up mods now and see how my trophies are looking up oh, i can't continue so i have to play new game now huh that's odd Bam. Let's look up if modes do exist in this universe. Do I have iPhone? No, it's not an iPhone. Uh, 29 minutes, yeah. Yeah, that's not that bad. So, I am. Um, oh, I have all trophies with my screen recording. Let's put that on. There you can see. See, haben alle Errungenschaften freigeschalten. 45 out of 45. We got it all. We got some nice screenshots taken. Can I show that to you right? Hey, hey. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That's out of the cutscene. That, for example. Okay, let's see up if this game already has mods. Oh, it does. I already saw them. Scores of both mods. Already looked for them. Let's see. Let's see. Ah, oh, it's just those two. Nothing moon. I feel like there was a third one here, but nothing new otherwise. Yo. 
Yo. Trainer plus 14 mods. Hmm. Maybe in the upcoming days there will be new mods. We'll see. Otherwise, I'm just going to throw re re shades on it and call it a day and play a little bit in the new game plus. New game, it's not new game plus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks for watching. Oh. And I hope your teeth pains are better than mine. Tooth pain? Pain? Yeah, who cares? Peace out.